how I found my purpose. It's what we were going we are going to share today. I'm Namus Mergoretu, your motivational speaker and counselor for the young youth. How are you? How is everything? How have you been going about with life? Uh, the reason as to why I want us to share about the way the way I found my purpose is because I know that in this world everybody was created with a purpose. Even you yourself, you are created with a purpose. Everything that has a purpose has a reason for existence. And that reason is why you are still living, is why that thing is still on and on and on. Um, so, uh, one thing you must know is that um, even if you find your purpose, it's not that things are going to just be a walkover, it's not that things are just going to be smooth, straight path, everything clear, no. Even if you find your purpose, things may be challenging, but um, just because it is your purpose, because it is the reason why God created you, your divine calling, it always keeps calling you back into doing it, into giving more value to people, attaching value unto the world through that purpose. Um, so I didn't know that my purpose was counseling, motivating people, hmm? talking to others in such a way in helping them to solve their emotional challenges. Uh, I didn't know, I didn't know. I just found myself doing it. I remember uh, where, while I was working in some hospital here in Uganda, some friend of mine used to keep bringing me her challenges, even advising her other friends to come and uh, seek counseling or solution for their challenges from me. And I didn't know, I didn't actually know that that was my calling. So sometimes some cousin sister of mine also came, she was staying with me. And one day she told me, but Mary, I think you can be a good teacher. I think you can be a good counselor. I don't know, every time you're always counseling me, you're always telling me how things are, why I should not do this, why this is good for me, this is not good for me, what, that, that. You're always wanting me to be nice, you're always advising me. Eh, Mary, Mary, how many times do you do it in a day? I didn't know that it was my calling, I didn't mind about it. So. You see, when something is your calling, you're always attracted to it. Eh? So, I am someone who likes watching. Actually, even before I had started creating my content, before I had started, I even opened up a YouTube account, I mean channel or Facebook account. I just loved following people who were adding value to me, like those motivational speakers. So, one day, I was listening to Dr. Ken Jacob. And I like him so much. I call him my mentor from a distance. So he's the one who was telling us how you can know that this is your purpose. He said your friends will tell you. You'll find other people consulting you in that area. Hmm? You'll find yourself repeating that thing over and over again. And you don't know why you keep doing that. And when I listened to that video, I started to notice. Why did my cousin tell me this? Why is my friend always referring other people to me to help them in that area, even her coming to me? So I started to do self-realization, self-realization through reading books, using internet, continuing to listen to those speakers on YouTube. And I want to tell you, that is how I found my purpose. Because I found myself, I was doing that thing and I didn't know. Because I remember even my mom, in case she had challenges with my young ones, she would always say, like, Mary, do I talk to them? Because Mary is the one who is good at talking to those, to those children and they listen to her. I didn't know. So that is how I realized my purpose. Through, when I listened to that video for Dr. K. L. Jacob, I found myself realizing that, oh, that is why people are consulting me all the time. Oh, that is why I find myself doing this over and over again, Just even subconsciously. Oh, okay. Now I realize that was my purpose. 
and I want all of you to realize your purposes. What do people tell you that you're good at? What is that thing you really find yourself doing over and over again and you don't get tired? What is that thing that you feel when you do it, you feel joyful, you feel fulfilled, you feel you have solved someone's problem or you have helped someone to be happy? What is that thing? could be your purpose. I love you so much. I remain Nabus Mary Verity, your motivational speaker and counselor for the young people. I love you so much.